Welcome back to another video of Let's Learn Flight Simulator together where you and I will be learning to fly together. Imagine after flying a long or a short flight you land your aircraft as smooth as it can get. Would you not want to stare at your landing over and over again or maybe record your landing? Apart from the boring cockpit and outside view, wouldn't it be fun to spot your landing or even take off from anywhere on the ground? Let me show you how you can use the drone camera so that you can replay your flying from wherever you would like. Before you use the drone camera, let me tell you that your flight controls get disabled when you are using it. So, you can either pause your flight to look around or you can use the drone camera while replaying your flight. Let's see how to use the drone camera in replay mode. You can also use these instructions to use the drone camera during your regular flight. Once you are sure of your starting position, Pause your replay so that you can set your drone position. To set your drone position, we need to access the drone camera first. From the UI, open your camera menu. Make sure your camera track recording is on, otherwise you won't be able to change the camera angle. To access the drone camera, click Showcase. You will find the camera drone option under the free camera option. Now, let's look at these options one by one. You can enable track IR if you have the track IR device. Drone follow mode does what it says. If you enable drone follow mode, your drone camera will follow your aircraft. If you disable it, your drone camera will be stationary even if your aircraft is moving. Drone lock camera mode locks the target view on the camera. Meaning, if you click drone lock mode looking at your aircraft at a certain angle, your drone will focus on the aircraft at that angle. Make sure to disable drone follow mode while using the drone lock mode. Drone focus mode can be changed if you would like to adjust the focus manually. Personally, I don't change that ever. I don't think I need to explain zoom level. You can adjust the zoom to zoom in or zoom out. Now let's see how to control your drone position. Before you change your drone position, you can adjust the drone speed and drone rotation speed to your preference. These are the default key assignments for your drone camera. Let's see how to use them. Let's use whatever we have learned today to get this camera angle. Disable the drone follow mode. Use the drone to get close to the nose of your aircraft before locking that view. This looks good. Now move your drone to your desired position. Are you ready? Let's do it. I hope this was useful. If you found this video useful, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching.